morning guys today is actually Whaley's too dark do I have to be here today is actually Whaley's birthday anybody who has a birthday around this time there's really not much you can do our group of friends we still wanted to like surprise Whaley so I decided to have everyone write a little note a little wholesome note send it to our post office and then from there I can just put everything together in a little journal that she can have I'm not good with surprises and the other thing is like we're with each other 24 8 I'm using a bunch of like washi tape to put everything together just because I do want this to be like fully customizable like I don't want to like make something because she's very specific about her like stationery and like her craft crafty stuff I guess using washi tape will let her be able to like take things out and like you know put it back together and this is the front and then when she flips it she'll be able to see everyone's notes here and then on each side on her, there will be like basically a blank page for her to put like a photo of someone so this is the journal that I got her um, I decided to get this one because she has a bunch of these she has the brown ones she has a tan she has a brown so she doesn't have the blue one which shows up more in the sun What do you want? I was looking for you. What do you want? I wanted my sticky bow inside the drawer. No. Okay. <laughs> I feel like this is so dangerous. I feel like if I get out of here with this, like she'll see me holding it. Can you guys still have something? Oh, but then if I move. <laughs> Am I gonna walk weird? <laughs> Alright, here we go. Super pretty. How come this doesn't have a box? Did you get this for me? You did? Happy birthday! Oh, thank you! I'm like, why does it have a sender? <laughs> Airplane ears. No. Oh, you're no, not done yet. You're not done down. These guys are like, thank God I don't have to get brushed. <laughs> Your hair is so greasy. Money could use dry shampoo. She gets really greasy up here. She loves getting her butt massaged right here. This is like her jam. This is how I'm kicking off my 27th birthday. Got a glass of wine and some string cheese. <laughs> Best combo. A little snuggle party. A little snuggle party. For my birthday meal, my baby offered to make me fish stew, but I'm his shoe, shoe chef? <laughs> Sous chef today. And I filmed it for my channel. So look out for the recipe if you guys are interested. Um, but yeah, it's really smoky in here. Probably can't really tell on the camera, but we have all the windows open because whenever you fry fish at home, 
is bad if you don't have one of these fans. <laughs> we basically have fish nuggets and this is all gonna go into one big pot of fish stew that will probably last us like two to three days. Good morning, watch. I just got some avocado here, then chopping some onions. Okay, now to finish my tamales. Take it out first. Ooh, hot, hot, hot. Grab some of the sour cream. A little bit of hot sauce. And there's my small little lunch. Mm. These are chicken tamales that I got from Costco. They come in a really, really big pack, but I'm finally done with them. It took about two weeks for me to finish. I'm not eating it every day, obviously. Really good. Mm. The hot sauce, uh, sour cream, and cheese makes it really, really elevated. Mm-hmm. Mm. So good. Mm -hmm. This is so you. Having something so special and I'm just eating stir-fried mushrooms. <laughs> That's fine, it's nice and quick. And rice. <laughs> oh! I've been trying out this hairstyle, guys. Do we like it? I am using a deep waver that I got on Amazon. But now that my hair is shorter, it actually looks like curls instead of crimps. And it's so easy. I just go in, I clamp it <clears throat> in sections and boom. And then I just <laughs> put it in this little knot up here. I think it's very scrunchy. cute. Thank you. All right, I'm gonna try his guac. I already know it's good. Was guac. Was guac. <laughs> he was makes was. the best sauces and dips. I don't ever doubt it or question it. Mm. Mm -hmm. I put just the mm. right amount of salt. If we bought this at Whole Foods, it would have been like a check. six dollars. It was like seven. Seven dollars. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> we need to ask our friends for more avocados when this quarantine is over. <laughs> Two of our friends have this huge avocado tree in their yard and it's just free, unlimited avocado. That's money right there. Mm -hmm. I'm like, you need to sell these on the street. Mm -hmm. You need to get a little stand at the farmer's market. They be like $2 a piece sometimes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The guac is so good. Mm -hmm. Got food coma after eating all that. Um, so I'm making this mushroom coffee mix from Four Sigmatic. It's got lion's mane and chaga. Not really, near, not really sure what chaga is or chaga. Oat milk. It's not as satisfying as like coffee, coffee, but it's help. As you can see, this is a freshly. Open bag of chips.
Telling you, we started training. You'll be good. No, don't give it to her. No. I didn't give it to her. I gave her this one, but she didn't take it. <laughs> <laughs> They're so salty. So bad for them, but I mean, <laughs> once in a lifetime. They love the crunch, crunch. Eat the plant. <laughs> <laughs> We're delusional. What you making? Bread. Oh. Again. Nice. Yeah. Garlic bread? Yeah. Nice. We gotta eat the garlic and we have to eat the bread. We have a lot of garlic right here. And then, uh, oh, I love when you make these. Uh, yeah, I made them from scratch, guys. <laughs> very, Recipe very much from scratch. Very, very much from scratch. Oh, huh? where the bag? Oh, right here. <laughs> no, I made it from scratch. Have you shown them how to make this recipe? So you basically just crush garlic. Uh huh. And then you apply butter to the bread. Uh huh. You put the crushed garlic on top of the bread. Uh huh. Oh, and then you sprinkle like rosemary or whatever kind of herb, mm -hmm. herb, <laughs> herb, parsley, <laughs> or anything, anything you have. Yeah. Any sort of herb on top to give it yeah. some. More flavor. I got this at Sprouts uh, two days ago, and it's not bad. Not bad. <laughs> sorry, I have allergies. <laughs> um, yeah, I kind of like this one, but I do like the one I got last time more. Cabinet souvenir from different vineyards. Oi! I just spent like the last hour and a half cleaning the garage, organizing everything, and like getting rid of stuff that we don't need. So I saw like all the camping stuff, and like I was super excited about camping for a while. And like just seeing it just reminded me how much I love camping. By the way, I do have a video up about camping and how it helps me personally and mentally, physically and everything um, on my own channel. So I'll link it in the description down below. So before this whole quarantine happened, like I packed a box full of like my camping stuff and like my gear and like all the stuff that I needed for camping, Michi stuff. I want to go camping so bad. I'm like itching to go. Ooh, my baby knows how to cook. <laughs> and you can obviously just mince it, but this way it really gets all the flavor out. Yeah, like you get it almost it almost becomes a paste. <laughs> yeah, but if you like chunks and like more like crispy chunks of gar mm -hmm. garlic, then you can just chop yours. Yeah. And then let me just show you how I finish it off. We have some parsley. Just like that, and then rosemary. If you like rosemary. I feel like rosemary is kind of weird sometimes, <laughs> especially when you bite it. But I put it anyways. But it, it just makes everything smell good. But I hate when I bite into a rosemary leaf, or whatever this is. Oh, you're putting a lot. This one's for you. That's why. Oh, so you trying to tell me that you love me? I just know you very well. <laughs> she does. The camera always makes our teeth look so white. You guys are always like, why do you guys have such white teeth? Girl, no, it is the camera. Because in real life, it's yellow. <laughs> you have really white teeth. Really? My teeth aren't that white. They're really yellow, actually. You guys are resting on two potatoes right now. <laughs> <laughs> but I have to share with you guys these cookies. We got them at Whole Foods today. I thought that it was going to be the crispy type, but it's so chewy. I love the chewy it's one. so good. Can you please close I couldn't stop eating it. Mm. Okay, let's see. And please don't judge our oven. I know you're doing it anyways, but just stop. So we almost never use this oven. We use it maybe once a year for Thanksgiving. And that's it. We always use this little guy because it's so much easier. It heats up way faster. And as we all know, in an Asian household, it is storage. <laughs> Here's the garlic bread. Looks really good. I put it in the oven at 350 for about, I wanna say maybe six minutes. It looks something like this. I actually don't love how it looks, but it tastes really good. The sauce is just, 
kind of bleh and boring looking, but it's delicious. Good morning and welcome to Waylee's Hair Salon. Today, we are going to give Wa a Korean, Korean boy Korean. transformation. I was inspired because I was watching Michelle's um, stories and she was doing her boyfriend's hair today. So that's what I'm going to do. How long has it been? You haven't cut it in like That's not the months. only thing that's long. <laughs> Your fingers? Arm. <laughs> <laughs> like it's, three months, huh? Since no, your last haircut? No, no. It's been like a month. That's it? Because mm -hmm. oh. Wa actually was like, what would it look like if I had a perm? So this will be our little preview. Are you per- You're like curling it, aren't you? Yeah. But isn't that like- <laughs> What the- Don't worry, I'm gonna style it. <laughs> I sign up for this. <laughs> wow. Wow, yeah. Oh my god. You have really nice shiny hair. Wow. Okay. Oh my god. So I'm just curling everything outwards. Focus. Your hair is so dark, you can't really see the dimension. Okay. Um, yeah, it's not going too well right now, but we're gonna put some product on it. Hopefully, it will give us the look that we're going for. Next up, <laughs> to finish off this very fabulous look, we're gonna take a little bit of hairspray. I'm gonna use some dry shampoo. We're gonna get some texture. <laughs> Is this supposed to go forward? Backward? Maybe it's supposed to go backwards. <laughs> um, I don't think I did it right. <laughs> I don't think he was too happy with the look, so you know. I'm gonna do my hair instead. This is the Bite Beauty Agave Nighttime Lip Therapy. I'll just use it throughout the day because I have really, really dry lips. I'm not really liking how straight it looks. So I'm gonna see how it looks if I put a little bit of a, a little curl in it just to give it some texture. I think it's kind of funny. I think it gives it just some texture so it's not so straight. I don't know. Is that cute or is that just too much. That's not it either. That's not, that is not cute. Do you like it? <laughs> I'm gonna try to look at mine. How do I look at it? Oh. Why is it so girly? I don't know. It's like girls at the... I don't know. I look like one of those uh, cool Japanese dudes. Oh, you kind of look like the Joker. What's something that a joker does? Oh, that laughing scene where he's like... <laughs> oh, Which yours wins? is cute! Is it? Yours is cute. I like yours. I feel like I look like a grandma. No, you look cute. Do you like it better than when it's straight? Uh, I like both. This is like a nice... Um, yeah, I, I don't know. We have a little clump right here. Yeah, I don't know what, what to do about this piece. Oh my goodness. Two old ladies. Two old ladies taking an afternoon snooze. She's so old. She usually can't hear me when I'm this close. She has no clue I'm here. This is my favorite time of the day when the sun starts coming through from this window. I like to sit here with this table. By the way, lots of questions on this table and I'm so sorry. I always forget to link it, but if you guys want to look for it, it is the table mate i'll try to remember to link it below <laughs> i'm so sorry i keep forgetting but yeah you guys can look it up on amazon as well and it comes with this little cup holder which is pretty useful it's kind of flimsy so i don't usually put anything in here but i kind of use it as an extension so that i can place my phone or my hard drive and sometimes i just put like things in here it's great for when you're just sitting at the couch or here and you want to surface you just bring this over this is my haircut. <laughs> so many of you guys asked, because I've just been wearing my hair in a bun since I'm just at home. But you guys have been wanting to see my shorter hair. This is what it looks like. This is not a good example of what it looks like because it's definitely cuter than this, but 
because my hair is really dirty and then I tried to do something with my bangs that just didn't it just I I cannot it's just really bad <laughs> anyways we're gonna take the dogs for a walk and probably barbecue again I haven't worn eyeliner in a really long time my lash extensions are pretty much all gone I have like a few pieces left on each eye and I thought maybe some eyeliner would help my eyes look a little more like me. That gives a little, a little something. Kind of helps fill the lash line in just a bit. I'm using the Kat Von D tattoo liner. I don't usually like wearing eyeliner anymore because I have monolids and I have really greasy eyelids. So it just kind of gets everywhere by the end of the day. But I remember this one was pretty good. So I'll check back at the end of the night. Another day, another barbecue. <laughs> We're eating pretty much the same thing as our last vlog. We have asparagus, mushrooms. Oh, this time we're having scallops instead of the steak that Wall had. We got some cherry tomatoes and the corn. I marinated that with some butter, salt, and pepper. We got all our seasonings here. Got my green tea. I love this green tea. It reminds me of Japan. I was drinking this almost every day like it was water. <laughs> Not almost every day. Every day. <laughs> and Wa's been loving his Sapporo. Oh, and I'm gonna use this plate today. This plate will fit everything that we're cooking. This was from our place. Super cute. I can definitely see a steamed fish on this plate. Wow, smells so good. I wish you guys can smell this right now. I'm gonna move the asparagus. Smoke. Okay. You guys should have seen how overwhelming it was. <laughs> so we had a lot of oil on the foil and I guess because the foil is getting really thinned out now but with the heat, it just like everything caught on fire. <laughs> it was so overwhelming. <laughs> and this corn, I, I hope it's okay underneath there. I hope it's okay. 